Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen, my name is Pop. This video tutorial in Ubuntu Basics shows the order of instruction in cascading style sheets. There are several instructions given in an EPUB regarding cascading style sheets and there is an order in which these are executed. I have got an EPUB showing in the caliber editor and over here is the text which is more or less what you would see when you are reading an EPUB on an EPUB reader. Over here is the same thing except that it also shows certain instructions built in. Now notice that there is a frame with some text and a picture and it's green and I have got an instruction right in the text that says it is light green but if I were to erase the word light green or to misspell it that instruction is ignored and now notice please that it is pink. Well let us go to the cascading style sheet itself and this is where most of the instructions are. I'm going to explain this to you. Across the top here there are all of the frames that I am using and below this one line there is a set of general instructions that are common to all of the frames and they're real simple this is just me so don't get confused F10 means it's 10 percent wide FA is auto width FH is half width half width to the right quarter width quarter width to the right 100 percent viewing area vertically 100 percent viewing area across the screen down here specifically these are the different widths so even though these are all general I've got specific instructions which add to or override these instructions please notice up here none of these say width so instead of putting all this information right here with each one of these instead I used all of these that are common up here and wrote them only once and then exceptions or additional things are all, mostly a one-liner. Well, notice right here that the background color says pink. And notice up here the background color in the general instructions says light yellow. You can think of this as the top of a mountain where water is flowing. It gets down to the first terrace. Now this instruction is being used. The last instruction would be right here and if it were in effect that's what would be followed. Since it is not in effect you go up the mountain and you follow this instruction not the one on top but the one right here. So let me misspell the word pink and watch it's going to turn to light yellow. Even more than that let's misspell light yellow it defaults to white. You can put in these instructions and just leave them and instead of commenting them out you can just misspell them. For that matter I've got color here for text and I can change the color of the text and this should turn red and that is all of the frames will now have red text. I'll misspell it. It goes back to the default, which is black. My name is Pop, and I thank you very much if you enjoyed watching this tutorial.